Welcome back to Dishing It. We are making our Turkish menemen. Yes, we are. And during the commercial break, we found out that one teaspoon equals one clove of garlic. That's what we heard. That's what we were told. If it's wrong, we apologize. But so you put six in. I put six because I had a half teaspoon. Right, half teaspoon. Yes, right. but yes. So three uh, cloves of garlic, salt to taste, and we're letting the simmer to take some of the liquid out. And then for garnish, also we're gonna add some mints. Oh, I love fresh mint, and I grow it in the summertime. But you know, this too. time of year, you gotta go get it. Yes, I love it. I love it too. How much? Just uh, uh, it said. Well, let me just take a look at that. It just says mint leaves for garnish. All right. Well, it does not it, specify a. You know, there's so many ways you can use this. I use this in tea. I use this in salads. Mm. I love mm. it. Love some mint. Now, also. With uh, traditional uh, shakshuka or minimum, they serve it with pita bread. Right. So I thought it'd be fun just to heat it up just a little bit over. So I'm going to turn this on a little bit. And we could heat up just, you know, lightly, not really toasting it, just heating up the bread. Oh, I love Here it. in a minute. Remember how good that last bread was when we toasted it and put garlic on it? On the, it was so On the top of the stove. Good. It's such a great way to heat up bread and get it all crunchy and crispy. By the way, I just want to say, I don't think this looks anything like the picture. Can we see the picture of this dish again? Because I don't know. Is that looking similar, Kelly? Or no, because no? we don't have the eggs in yet. I know, but look at the background. Uh, the, the background, background does look, look like similar, this? I think. Okay. Yeah, I think, we're on, I think we're on the road to success. I hope so. I believe I we are. I just don't. It feels good to me I right don't now. know. Yeah. I think that is thickening up a little bit. Look yeah, at that. I, I think so, too. I'm just going to do a little bit more mint because it's good. It's you know, real good. I, yeah, and you could probably garnish that to, to taste for the individual who's uh, eating it. Oh, yeah. Mint to taste, like they yeah, say. Yeah, no, well, I'm to mixing taste. them together. Is that what we're supposed to do <laughs> for garnish? Well, I was going to do it separate, but that's fine. All right. Well, we mix things up sometimes, so we... Well, you do, Kelly. <laughs> Look at your face. I was like, Look at your uh, face. I was like, what, is uh, that, what does it say? But you have extra mint leaves, right? Because oh, then you oh, can yeah. set, like, you know what I'm saying? I like can you put set, them on. Yeah, I have lots of And extra. you can set, like, uh, like, you know that little, like, make a little design oh, totally, on the top? Totally. Maybe just yeah. for fun. I'll have those ready for that. Yeah, of course. Uh, okay. Do you want to... I'm heating the skillet up. Right, do you want to cut some bread? pita into... Uh, what do you think? Quarters? Does that sound... Um, yes, and you're going to spray some pan yeah. in there? All right. Quarters, I think, will fit in the skillet. Get that going. You know, pita bread, I think, is used a lot. I, I ate pita bread when I was first in Israel, when I went there when I was 12. That's where I had my first falafel. Ooh, how was it? I don't know if it? we've ever made falafels on the show. I think we might want to try that sometime. It was so good. Uh, you know what? I've never made a falafel, and I don't even know how long it takes to make. Um, well, I mean, you can buy. It, it's got chickpea in it, and you can buy it already made up. And honestly, um, We'd have to do that for the show. Um, it has oh. all the spices in it and everything. You just add water and let it sit for a few minutes, and then you fry it. I would love to try it. Oh, I think it'd be so good. And they, they put it on pita bread with uh, tomatoes and, mm. all, and all kinds of great stuff. That sounds delicious. Yeah. That sounds yummy. Now, see, the thing is, I don't think the eggs will take that long to cook. Oh, I agree. But I don't know when we need to add them. It's looking pretty good mm -hmm. right now. All right, you want me to put these in? Plop them in. Let's just see. I don't know if we'll fit them all in there. Uh, probably just do one at a time. I was thinking like one pita bread at a time. Oh, what, like, like one, that? Four quarters, okay. yeah. Okay. And we'll, we'll just see. I don't know if I have that hot enough. I'll be honest with you. I don't even know. All right, that's looking good. Now, again, how long do we cook the eggs? I mean, because I'm thinking oh, that Oh, let me tell you. That won't take long, really. That won't really. take long. Um, let it simmer uncovered until the eggs are lightly cooked, eight to 10 minutes. Oh, well, then so maybe, maybe we, we should, should put the eggs them. in. Okay. I'll turn that heat down. Okay, so Kelly, yes, would you want? mind taking these uh, organic free range eggs? Yes, from they're Price beautiful. Butter? And I'm gonna. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna scoop a place, and oh. you're gonna put it in the. You're little, gonna have. I'm gonna make a it? basket. Okay. No, crack it on the. Uh, our viewers told us not to crack it on the edge oh. of the pan because of shells. So we're gonna crack it like on here or on there. Okay. And we're gonna flip that right there. Okay, perfect. And I'm gonna make you another little place. Make me a nest. Our viewers tell us when we do something wrong, Kelly. <laughs> Oh, we know. Oh, we know. We do. we hear about it. Okay, there's one. And I'll tell you, Kelly, I've had the worst luck at home recently with getting shells in my have scrambled you? eggs. Oh, really? It's, oh, I don't know what Jeremy, I'm doing wrong. Jeremy, I have an aversion to a shell. I, I don't know. It's the texture. It's a texture thing. And if I get one, I'm just done with whatever I'm eating. I can't. I, don't go, blame I can't you. go back. I don't blame you. That's a. That has a lot of. Ooh, okay. Oh, goodness, there, there we go. go. How many do you need? Two more. Six total. Oh, six. I'm trying to make All room right. here. A spot for me. Yes, there we go. That's nice. So far, so good. 
That's mm -hmm. pretty. Okay, I'm gonna do one right here. Oh, I'm trying not to cover the eggs, because we wanna see them. Eggs are like a perfect food. I oh. ate eggs yesterday for lunch. Scrambled eggs. Oh, you did? Them. Yeah. I love an egg sandwich sometimes. I did have a little bit of a reasoning though. My dog Gaga's tummy was upset. When she has upset tummy, I feed her scrambled eggs. Oh really? Well, I feed that to our dogs too. Yeah, and it helps her tummy so she doesn't throw up. So they love eggs. Um, sometimes we really do cook for the dogs. I mean, uh, yeah, I don't blame you. A little you. bit of broth, a little yeah. bit of eggs, and sort of that, that kind of thing. And you can get them fairly inexpensive too. Oh boy, that is really that happening, is a, isn't it? That's a happen. Well, hey, that you looks want good. Me to turn that down? Yes. Okay. I got a little anxious, but that was looking good. It's looking good. Now, oh, wow, do you want me to get a plate to put the, the extras on, or can we just set them on the side so we can get the others in there? Did I? Oh, I brought more plates. Sorry, I All meant right. to move this back to this. I hate bending down on TV. I'm sorry, guys. Sorry, I did that. Sorry, I do that all the time, but I hate it. <laughs> Okay. I'm so They'll sorry. Forgive you, right? I hope they forgive me. Here you go. We all right. So that's it. for that when that gets done. And pretty much. We should have brought some butter out here, Jeremy. <gasps> oh. What were we thinking? I think those might be done. Oh, I think they're okay. done. Yes. Here we go. Okay. There's some pizza. Maybe Let some me more, spray this. Yeah, yep. more Pam. There we go. There we go. Right. There we go. That's toasting up nicely. Toasting it up nice. Yes. We'll make sure we're on. So this so. is really interesting to watch. This, hey, you, you spaced that out really nice. Look at that. Oh, I did. I was just. I didn't know what I was doing. I was no, trying no, not to cover good. them. Looks good. I see that uh, some of them are starting to really kind of get the whites are starting to cook. I might, do you think I should turn it up a little bit or no? Um, do I don't know. Okay? I think that's pretty good. And it said to cook those eight to ten minutes. I think yeah. that's going to be perfect for by the by the time, time yeah time we uh, get back. Here. Let's see. Let me. Oh, see, that's toasting nice. Yeah. But I don't mind if it's kind of a little. Crunchy. I like. You know, I like it crunchy. So that's good. Oh man, we had a place growing up in uh, Dallas uh -huh. called the Pita Pocket. Ooh. And it was our favorite. The pitas they made, you know, they stuffed them with all the good stuff. Yeah. I don't know if it's still there in Garland, Texas, but I think I need to go next time I'm home to see if it's still there. That sounds delicious. And um, and we could only eat their special treats because they weren't very. They were. They were kind of pricey. Kind of. I get that. Yeah. So it was a special treat if we got to eat at the Pita Pocket. Oh, that's nice. I just remember the we sauce the they put meat. on it. What so kind of? Good. What, what, I was don't, it, what was on the inside? I was a kid. I have no idea. It was like meat. And lettuce and cheese. So it was like a taco in a pita. Yeah, they opened up the pita bread and you ate it like that. Yeah, it was oh, that so good. So good. Yeah, see, that's how you do with the uh, uh, the falafels too. Do you okay. want to do any more? Or we did enough pita. We, we have time uh, to do another one if you want to. We might as well do it while we're while, while we're, we're waiting doing on it. commercial yeah. break. All right. When we come back, we'll be trying this minimum. Hey, that song. You want to sing it? Sorry, I just 